Hello everybody and welcome back to Spiral the Dragon. Hopefully I'll have a string of videos here with no audio issues because I've just had a big old string of real disasters. So <laughs> we're going into the, what, what the hell is that, Terrace Village? I think that's what it said. I, I honestly wish I would have actually, let's see what it says. Yes, Terrace Village. And there's a guy with a, oh, sh I, I, th I thought that was a chainsaw but it's a little shocker stick. So these guys, I can tell, already tell, are going to be real assholes, because I know you can't charge them because they're big dudes. So we got to shock them. Let me not shock them. This guy's a charge. It, uh, it's, I'm getting better at differentiating who I need to charge and who I can fire. I'm, I'm glad, because, I mean, I'm already pretty deep into the game, and if I haven't figured that out at this point, I don't know. Those guys have little cannons, which I think is... You could consider cheating, because bullshit. But I think later on, they get guns. So, I mean, if you want to talk cheating and bullshit, that's... That's it right there. They give them freaking guns, like... This is a child, child's game, no guns. No guns allowed. Oh, that's... yeah. Press the wrong button, obviously. And now we're actually... we're rolling. We're rolling this level. I'm hoping that we don't get hung up on a, another level like we did with, uh the super jumps in the end of whatever world that was the magic world the not the last world essentially I was trying to think of the name of it and I cannot remember it's not magic crafters it's like something else maybe might be magic crafters couldn't honestly tell you like I like I'm paying attention to the game but at the same time I can't memorize all the names it's like if you asked me to memorize all the names of all the dragons that I had to. What was up here? Oh, that was just like random crap up there. All the dragons that I freed, it's like, well, I remember like Zeus. And it's not because I actually remember the dragon, it's because I remember that they have sweet names like Thor, and Thor had a stupid voice. I mean, it's just the guy's voice, but they gave it the dragon named Thor a bad Watch one. Out, Spyro. Norks in these parts have discovered the power of electricity. Yeah, so they shock the ground essentially, just like in Overworld. And it's pretty. Oh, okay, perfect, perfect. I was gonna say it's pretty easy to tell. What is this firework gonna break? Yeah, I figured it was something over there. I just wanted to make sure I could see what it is. Okay, we're just gonna run around this actually, because I don't really wanna. Okay, I thought we broke this. Question mark? Maybe not. Oh, there's another firework. Maybe that'll do. I just gotta get up there. Oh, come on. Yep. A little bit of lag there. I don't know. I honestly don't know if that comes through. Holy shit, there's a lot of those chests to break. Oh, okay. I thought kind of maybe I assumed that uh, if you shock them before... I mean, not if you shock them. If you kill them before they... Uh, or after they unleash their shock, it would stop immediately, but I guess it's... They just initiate it, and then after it's been initiated, I mean, there's nothing you can do. You just have to wait it out, I guess. So I gotta get up there somehow. Probably a big old loop to get up here. You gotta, like, loop around, and if you fall down, you gotta do the whole damn loop again. Okay, let's wait. Let's actually... Okay, now let's go. And I'll get this guy, lovely. Because I really don't want to collect my own champs. I think that's that, that's by far the worst punishment to give you by actually getting hit. Not that you're getting closer to death, because you can you can avoid most people. Good job, Spyro. One day you'll be able to tell all the dragons about your amazing. Yeah, I had enough of him already. Just the way he was speaking, I was like, ugh, I'm done with you. But uh, you can avoid most enemies. Pretty easily. Grab the damn thing already. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Pretty easily. Like, they're not too tough, at least at the age of 20-something. They're, pre they're pretty easy. At the age of 10, might have been a different story, but, uh... Okay, please stop shock sticking me. Thank you. Um... So, like, getting close to death is like... Yeah, it's kind of a shitty situation. But, in reality, the, the worst part is that you actually have to pick up your own damn jams. Which, I mean, is just laziness, but at the same time, you get used to having a friendly little sparks to pick up all your shit, so why would you need to? It's like having a mom. I mean, that's not a good way to say it, but 
It's the truth. When you're a kid, they just pick up after you. They hate it. And I mean, I don't blame them. I hate picking up after myself. Never mind. Picking up after somebody else. Okay, so we see what that guy's attack actually is. He's like a little zap, 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 zap. Which doesn't do a whole bunch. So, what's down here? I thought... You can hear the little... Lifty lift. So there's a lift somewhere. Maybe... It's not right here. Maybe it's back here? No, no, no. We're gonna find it. It's somewhere. Because I feel like it's the secret to success. So we're over here, and we're hearing a lift. Ah, right there. It, 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 it act technically is the secret to success because it brings us to the higher level. Which will get us to where we desire, I believe. So, where do we want to go? I guess just straight across here. I don't see any jammy jams over on that platform. I don't think there are any. So I guess we'll just kind of leave that be. Ooh, a tanner. A tanner. I wonder why they made gold 10, but the purple 25 like I, I understand the the logic of like legendary gear being purple or orange and gold is only 10 though like not sure I guess to get over there maybe we need to get back up there and then like fly long distance over there maybe we'll jump around here jump 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 around and maybe, maybe that's our best bet. Oh, we have to get up there. How the hell do we get up there? Question. Oh, right here, actually. Blends in. It's like, um, I didn't see any way to get up there. But obviously there is a, where there is a will, there is a way. Maybe we just fly this all the way over here. Look at that. It's almost like it was made to be like this. Now we just can't miss any of the jumps, essentially. Because I'm not... <laughs> I really don't want to have to go back there and do all that again. It's not like it was too tricky, but it's just like... <sighs> can't be bothered. Oh, we did miss one gem there, though. Oh, shit. Up, oh, please. Thank you. They're not... I thought I fired off the firework, but apparently not. There are a couple boxes back here. Which I missed. And they're on the ground floor, so I can... I can actually grab those later. Don't have to worry about them right this second. So we need to be over there, and we need to... Uh, there are, isn't anything on top of those two platforms. So we should be fine to, I suppose, just fly over here right now. Oh, easy. Easy game. Probably, I want to say 400 on this level. Just because I don't know where the other 100 would be. <laughs> I'm hoping there's only four, 400. And there is. Imagine that. 400, 400, 2 to 2. So we're perfect. Perfect. So this video is only 8 minutes long. It only took us 8 minutes to do this. So probably do 2 world. Not 2 world, but 2, uh. 2 levels. Damn, it sucks when words escape you like that. It's like. It's a, it's a, it's a basic kind of word. It's not like it's. Uh, a fancy word like I don't okay so I'm, I'm not gonna say a fancy word here because I just have too many so <laughs> but but it's not like it's, it's, it's a difficult word because I never feel like I get tripped up on difficult words when I, I need to actually use them in a situation but when it comes to the simple words it's like well why does that escape me right I'm sure it happens to lots of other people but it's like come on dumb brain let's figure this thing out it's not that difficult so we're going to come over here, kill this boar. I was hoping for a free life, but whatever. And we're going to do Misty Bog. Hopefully it won't take us... We have seven minutes. Hopefully it won't take us 20 minutes. I'm hoping... I want to keep him like, under 25. So we're going to plow through this as fast as we can while getting everything. I mean, given that should have been my goal in the first... Okay, let's, let's get that guy. For some reason, I didn't register that he had uh, pants of steel. Now, here are these assholes. They remind me of the, the the wall thingies from Zelda. I don't honestly remember the name, but they drop down and, like, eat you up. And they're a bunch of jagoffs. They can go screw themselves because they're 
the most annoying part. I, I at least, especially if you get caught, and you don't, and they can scare the shit out of you too. Okay, Tongue Man, it's enough out of you. I don't know what these are supposed to be, like a hybrid, uh, frog jumpy thing. There, get, never mind, not jumpy thing. It's frog or jumpy. Um, hybrid frog and I don't know, some sort of like Growlithe. <laughs> it's a Pokemon, but I'm trying to think what the hell they're. Oh shit, that was cutting down close. These, like, they charge you from a good distance away too. And I mean, I figured I'd show off what they actually do. Not intentionally, by complete accident, but it gives me an excuse to say, oh yeah, I meant to do that. I'm gonna come over here first before we got the dragon, just so we can kill these jerks. And that guy was glitched inside of the, the boar, but yet he still managed to get a free hit off on us, which is bullshit, because I would have killed him. If I would have actually hit him. But I didn't. I hit him with fire instead of the correct attack. So, I mean. Probably wouldn't have actually killed him, but whatever. Be on the lookout for attack frogs. They are That's what they are. They're attack frogs. I was trying to think of what they actually. Like, were hybrid of, but apparently they are literally just attack frogs. I want to find. I guess I can't really go back that way. I might have to, like, loop around from the end to get back there. So we kind of SOL on finding um, chickens without progressing. We have to find them in front of us, not behind us. So I guess that's what we'll do. We see a chicken over there. So we're going to go this way, tackle this part of the level, and then come back. Because I feel like that can't be the end. The end has to be the other way. And there is Sparks, my best friend in this entire game, just because he gathers for me. Oh shit, 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 shit. I, I, I didn't think we were actually gonna... What's that? Can we get there? I'd imagine probably not, but it'd be interesting to see if you could. Like with uh, three hits and flying from the highest peak. Maybe you could. I honestly don't know. Come here, attack frog. Oh, there's a lot of dudes over here. I think we're kind of fucked. Yeah, we are. A lot of guys in there. But at least we have our three-hit sparks back. We don't really need to kill these guys, but we're going to kill them anyway, just because they're all nicely lined up for us. And break these, just so we don't have to do it later. Come over here, and try not to get hit by anything. Because we're trying to clear out that room, and we're going to need as many hits as we can possibly take. Oh, shit. And we immediately take a dive <laughs> into the pond, like an idiot. So we're gonna just charge them. Oh, okay, apparently that's not the solution. Let's go in and out, just shake and bake, in and out, okay. There we go. I think that should be good. We do have a, a butterfly sitting back there, so we can definitely go grab that. And we will spawn from here now, from Damon. Thanks for releasing me. It seems like I've been trapped in here since I- Yeah, yeah. All, like, half of them. <laughs> say thanks for releasing me no 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 not half but like a quarter say thanks for releasing me a quarter say uh thanks for releasing me i feel like i've been in here forever how long has it been and then they don't remember because they're old as shit and then the rest there's still 50 percent. so let's figure out our math here our mathematics um what do the rest say the rest probably say something either useful or there might be a higher percentage of ones that just go, how long have I been here? Okay, I think we just, come on. Damn it. We'll see if we have to collect everything again. I just don't like dying. Now we got all these gems. Can we jump anywhere from here? I mean, we could probably jump back all the way over here. Yeah, we can. So that's, I guess, the way you get out. Instead of having to backtrack I mean which is nice I like that they give you ways to traverse the level without actually backtracking which is kind of boring as hell to do it sucks when you have to do it in games and especially like in this game when you need to backtrack to 500 so we need to get quite a bit down here so maybe well I mean we immediately start off with two tens so 
I feel like we're gonna find a good majority down here. Which it is nearly half just in this basement area. If we are 100% so far. Backtracking. Backtracking. Backtracking sucks. Especially when you have to go back for a, a one gem or a, a two treasure or whatever the hell they're called. Thank you for releasing me. Yeah, see, that's 25% of them right there. Which, I mean, I can imagine it'd be kind of tough to get 50 or 75 or however many there are. I actually don't, I don't know how many there are. Something like 75 or something like that. To have all individual dialogue saying something brand new. I mean, you, you could, but then you're just wasting your budget there instead of putting it into the game where it would be more beneficial, I suppose. And I hope I haven't talked about all this shit over and over again, and over, and over, and over, and over. Because... I feel like I might have. I, and I can see myself doing it, too. I'm gonna grab the last dragon of this level, I think, is Bubba. Finally one with a weird name. I'll tell you what to do with those creatures. Smash them, Spyro! Stamp them out and squish them and squash them! <laughs> uh huh. How about charge them and flame them? We are dragons after all. I'm not saying Bubba's a weird name, but for a dragon compared to Thor and names of gods, Bubba is a bit peculiar for <laughs> for his name. Um, what are we at? 378. Maybe I'm missing it somewhere, but I, I thought there was... Get him to just charge into these fellows here. There we go. Now we just gotta clean up this one. So we're missing a hundred somewhere. A hundred, one hundred. Um, yeah. So we gotta figure out where the hell that is. I see all the sparkles up there. So we gotta get on top of there somehow. So if we can get onto that, the railing, the side railing there, we should be fine. I don't even know if you need to come from up here. But we are going to come from up here. The sparkles are a nice touch, kind of at least give you some idea of where you actually need to go instead of just being completely lost for two hours. And that will not be enough, I don't think. But we can go across this way to this tree trunk. Tree, tree trunk? Tree trunk. And I actually had no idea that this was even here. So, I, I mean, I've, I've played the game before, but I didn't even know that this... Like, just running through the level, I didn't even see it, to be honest. Okay. Let's clean this up here. And... Is that an, all of them? Come on. Perfect. So now we got to get to the end. Can we see the end from here? I bet we can make it all the way to the end from here. Land right in it. Perfect. It's almost like it was made to happen. I like the, the perfect amount of, of treasure. Not having it like 65, 43 or something dumb like that. I actually like the perfect amount. I don't know why. I just, just need it like that. Which I, th I think is the only reason why I'm actually doing this 100%, quote unquote 100%. <laughs> because I, internally I'm like, I need it to be like that. We're going to make it like that. So, it appears as though our next level will be... Okay, we flew right through it. Um, this one right here. Which is going to be... Metalhead. Which is the boss of this level? I don't think we're fighting him yet. We're gonna go check around this corner here. I don't honestly remember if there's another one over here somewhere. I don't want to be going against Metalhead, to be honest. Not, not, at least not yet. Can we get up here? No. So we've done Terrace Village. We've done the flying one. We've done... Yeah, there's nothing else over there. Come here, boar. Oh, okay. I challenged him and he... Oh, there is another one. Yes, I forgot. The tree one. Like, we're not... There's no way we're done already. Because there's... Yeah, there has to fill up the screen there. At least for up until the final of the world. This one, 
treetops and then metalhead, and that'll probably be the next video, just because treetops will probably take, I don't know, like, eight minutes, metalhead will take four minutes, that's, then we'll go check on, we'll go start, get into the next world. But, to stop making you dizzy, this is the level we're gonna be doing, we're gonna run away from it, because it's loud, makes lots of noise. So the next level will be treetops, so, thank you for watching, if you liked it, leave a like, if you'd like to see some more, subscribe, and I'll see you next time, in Spiral the Dragon. Thank you.